Do you guys want to be in with the chance of winning this insane looking interstellar on my car right now? And if the answer is yes, make sure you are following these three simple steps. First of all, make sure you are subscribed to the channel with notifications on so you don't miss a future upload. Second of all, make sure you have dropped a like on today's video. And third of all, comment your details down below. But as well as that, tell me which platform you are on. The winner of this regular interstellar is going to be selected when the channel hits 150,000 subscribers. So best of luck to every single one of you and I hope you go on to enjoy today's video. Okay, so once this trade actually goes through from just over two weeks of absolutely grinding this trading series, I can officially say I've gone from 100 credits all the way up to my dream black market. guys so welcome back to the channel once again i hope you're having a fantastic and safe day as always and today in this live premiere we are going to be going through the finale of the brand new series go from nothing to the titanium white interstellar okay so where do i begin pretty much over the past couple of weeks if you didn't realize already i've been doing a nothing something series going from 100 credits all the way up to this dream black market of mine so honestly if you haven't seen the rest of this series i would highly recommend checking it out this whole episode is being premiered live so a load of my subscribers so if you are new around here and do want to stick around for this content in the future and see more Rocket League trading tips and tricks, make sure you are subscribing to the channel and turning on post notifications so you don't miss a future live stream. And if I'm being brutally honest to myself, I've done so many series within 2020 so far, so I guess 2,500 likes on this video, and if you guys somehow crush that goal, I'll do another Nothing Something series very, very soon. And yeah, let's jump straight into it. And quickly, before we do get into the video, I'd like to give a huge shout out to AOA.com for sponsoring today's Rocket League video. This site provides flexibility and safety to every single order if you want to buy and sell loads of different Rocket League items, they do some insane deals on there, and use code Zenic at checkout to get yourself 3% off every single order. Okay, so straight away, I've got to admit that some of these trades are actually recorded maybe 48 to 72 hours ago, so obviously don't take my word for everything I'm going to say, but this first trade is going to look absolutely terrible for the series, because this was one of the first trades I did after the previous episode, obviously, and yeah, the prices were a little bit different, so I'm paying 1650 for a heat, and I'll just check the spreadsheet now, it's 1,500 to 1,600. Not a clue why it's dropped so much. But obviously, at this time, I'm pretty sure it was like 1.8 to 2K. So, obviously, there's going to be a lot of profit made here. But, yeah, black markets are still dropping. Not a clue why. I'm pretty sure the market crash would have stopped by now. But, it's kind of... It keeps on going, it keeps on going, so it's really unpredictable, but even so, you'll see why I take this trade. Okay, so next up, something I can suggest as well, and you could probably get a little bit more if you don't take my advice, but it will take you an absolute year to do so. So, non-crate variables right now, they're sort of sat around 90. They used to be 100, but obviously with the market crash, they've dropped a little bit as well. Just like non-crate imports right now, 70, they used to be 80, non-crate variables are now 90, and they used to be 100. So yeah, getting yourself 100 per, do it. If you get the opportunity, 100% take that trade. And obviously, right now, I've been sadly to non creative very rare since episode 5 or 6. So, it's been a while to say the least. But eventually, obviously, after a little bit of patience, I get myself 100 per. And there's always going to be people paying 100 per. You've just got to find the right person. And yeah, we're more than, more than happy to take this trade, obviously. Okay, so I've started to realise that white zombies just aren't dropping lower than 2k. And that's obviously fantastic to make yourself profit and actually to have a stable item. They're sort of selling around 1.9 to 2k. But in the long run, every single time you can get 2k credits and obviously with this trade heatwave right now i'm pretty sure by this time i dropped another 50 on a spreadsheet and these white discos oh my god i cannot believe how hard they were to sell literally not a single person wanted them and when they did obviously i got offers like hex lab it was horrific also as well the what is it instead of blueprint right there is about i think it's like 600 credits instead so a little bit of profit is going to be made here obviously within the next clip you're going to see i do have an instellar because i paid the 2000 credits to redeem it so yeah just to clarify also as well the instellar right now is 2.3 to 2.5k so it's dropped a little bit but when i was recording this i think it was like 2.8 to 3k but realistically every single one was selling for around 2600 so just to make sure because you're going to see some other trades as well that i've recorded maybe three or four days ago i just want to like clarify every single time to prove to you that i'm obviously doing this trade a little bit early and i'm just like pretty much helping you out of the guise of the prices because they have dropped a little bit to say the least but yeah white zombies i hate to be a hypocrite because i just said every single time you can get uh 2k but at this point I wasn't getting any trades whatsoever. The interstellar wasn't selling. So I thought, you know what? The best way to do things is just to grab credits. And yeah, I wasn't getting 2k whatsoever. So 1,950 came up and I just decided to take it. So yeah, now that I know in my head at complete minimum, I'm going to be able to get myself 1,900 for the white zombies. I just thought, you know what? The best way to get rid of interstellar, now I've got that stable price in mind, is going to be to grab more white zombies. I know it's really boring to see just me buying the same items over and over. But if it works, it works. I don't want to show you tactics that aren't really going to work for you. So white 
Zombies, they're always going to be a secure 2k. So if you're doing like Heat Waving ads or any Black Markets and ads, if you can like obviously guarantee profit, get yourself a White Zomber because yeah, there's always going to be a massive demand there because it is one of the most popular wheels in the game currently. So what, the regular Interstellar, obviously like it, like I said already, it was 2,600 plus getting myself 820 credits and a few ads. Definitely going to take that trade. Okay, so yeah, obviously I'm not going to say no to another 1,950 that pops up for these White Zombers because getting 2k would take a long time and obviously at this point in time I'm thinking right this finale could actually happen so all I want to do is just make as much profit as I can in a quick time because if I just wait sit there for hours just for 50 more credits it's not going to be beneficial if you get me so yeah obviously doing this trade I'm sorry it's boring but is what it is you know I've just got to take this trade get the pure credits in so yeah I'll happily take it okay wow so I just checked the spreadsheet once again obviously just to recap on the prices because when I got this trade right here I think a few days ago it was 800 to 1k for the pink octane and right now it's 750 to 950 and obviously if you're paying 100 less you're guaranteed profit so paying 650 is probably the route to go down if you're if you're wanting to get a pink octane obviously to make yourself that profit and I just can't believe the market's still dropping, obviously. Like, credit demand right now is amazing because there's so many good items coming to the item shop. And also, as well, the golden eggs. You can make a lot of profit that way, but... It is ridiculous how far some of the items are dropping. The Octanes are sort of a little bit more stable, but Black Markets are really taking a hit. But yeah, regardless, we'll definitely take this trade. Alright, so once again, yeah, I'm in disbelief because when I did this trade, obviously, the Parallax is going to be 700 to 800 and paying 600 credits is guaranteed profit. Yeah, power has gone down to 600 to 700, which still isn't that bad, but it's just absolutely shocking how much stuff is dropping. And I think... People are just waiting for the item shop. I think that's the main thing right now. Because obviously there's been leaks about like the white ZSR comes to the item shop. White Dominus GT. Then you've got the holographic Dracos. You've got the white Type S. Then you've got white Julian Dragons. White Hellfire. So much stuff is leaked to come to the item shop very soon. So I think people are just collecting credits. Getting ready. And yeah, obviously there's still going to be a massive credit demand for a week or so at least. So yeah. Obviously we'll definitely take the trade at the time. Okay, so on the spreadsheet right now. I checked the Labyrinth. And obviously at the time it was 400 to 500. But like the octanes have actually done a little bit it's turned into a heart rate so it just goes up and down day after day goes up and down in price so right now it's actually 350 to 450 but i guarantee within the next few days it's definitely going to be back to that 400 to 500 mark so at the time obviously paying 300 absolute w right there there's pretty much guaranteed profit on the table but at the same time obviously i hopefully will be able to get 400 I really don't know, just because obviously the fact that the market is on an absolute mad one right now. And what I suggest, if you've got credits, sit with them. Obviously, if you do want to go out there and make profit, go ahead. But I don't highly invest just recently, because obviously the item shop is definitely going to shake things up. Okay, so yet again, another black market that has taken a massive hit from this market crash. And no surprise as well, because it's the second best black market in the game right now. It was the best, but it got taken over by 95% of the community's opinion. Anyway, it's going to be Dissolver. So we're paying 2150 at the time of recording it was two i think right now is 2.2 to 2.4 so it's dropped 100 because it was 2.3 to 2.5 when i did this trade but even so it was so difficult to sell you'll see later in the video i'm pretty sure i do sell it for either an underpay or just a little bit of profit but even so obviously we're paying a really cheap price at the time 150 less than the minimum value but yeah another black market has taken a massive massive hit of the market crash so for the people that are tuning into the live premiere thank you so much i don't really know how many viewers we're gonna get because i think the last time i did it i had like 200 but i think i had like 60k subs back then so i don't really know how many we're gonna get obviously we'll have to wait and see but of it yeah we've got two more trades to go then we're on the white and seller so yeah make sure you are staying tuned but yeah cobalt octane right now i'm pretty sure it's 800 to 1k so it drops a little bit but at the same time paying 700 it's gonna be a w because even getting a min value on every single octane is quite easy to be fair black market's a little bit harder so yeah i'll say prioritize getting painted octanes right now because they're gonna be so easy to flip so yeah we'll happily take that trade okay so moving on to the very last regular trade of the whole entire series is gonna be this one right here for the pink octanes so obviously paid 700 earlier so getting my anything more would probably just be a w and i'll take it because every single owner and i say that with a passion wanted pure credits and i got offered i kept on getting nt wide all over the shop just because all of it was just item offers you know i've got dissolver there i've got power three octanes and i got a lab and then a few other items so they were just thinking no i want pure credits i don't want a load of stuff that i've got to go and sell so i was thinking right the best way of doing things is to slowly chip away at my inventory until i get someone that obviously has an offer once like cheap amount of credits and then bang we would take it but yeah obviously we got this trade right here and we move on to the very final trade okay 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 so here we are the final trade of the whole entire series we can see that beautiful black market in all its glory but i've got a bit of explaining to do because this trade was actually done maybe three or four days ago so the prices 
let's just say I've actually gone down a little bit on this trade. So Dissolver's dropped, Power's dropped, Lab's dropped a tiny bit as well. Both the Octane's dropped a bit as well. And then the Grip Strides are like safe. I'm pretty sure they're the same price. So I added it up. It's around 7,500 credits that we're paying. And instead of right now, it's just shy of 8k credits. So I thought, you know what? Let's just take this trade and bang. We get it. I can't even believe when this went through, I was so, so gassed. And we finally got the Dream Black Market from 100 credits. So, yeah, you can take a look at it right now. And I just feel like because, obviously, on my main account, I've got, like, White Octane, etc. It just matches so nicely when it's got darker colors. But, obviously, in this account, we've just literally got this in seller and a load of random trash. So, it doesn't really, like, work too well. But just taking a look. It is absolutely beautiful. I'm definitely going to buy the Striker one as well when the prices drop a little bit more. But, yeah, I am so, so glad we finally got a series complete because i know there's going to be hundreds of people watching this live i just want to say right now that i was not motivated whatsoever to get this series done because i uploaded egg openings and they got like three times the views of this series even though this takes obviously hours and hours out of my days to get sorted out and edited and the egg openings take like a minute so obviously i wasn't the most motivated but considering the insane support you guys were giving me you know that's what motivated and kept me going doing this series and i'm so so glad we finally completed it so yeah we have in fact come to an end of an era but obviously i'm going to be giving away a regular in Stello in just over a thousand subscribers time so if you are new around here do you want to stick around make sure you're subscribing to the channel and turning on post notifications it's definitely going to be an extreme number to go for but if this video gets 2500 likes i guess i'll do a brand new nothing something within the next month or so and also as well my instagram is zenikyt all one word link in description let's try get 9k followers on there because we are so so close and yeah thank you all that's watching the premiere for watching thank you all for subscribing thank you all for the insane support and yeah i'll see you guys next time